Okay, so you've got a problem with um, not being able to play back certain w wave types. Um, one of them that I've come across uh, for DaVinci Resolve is the OGG file. Uh, it will not see it in the database. Uh, so you need to convert it. And for this, I'm going to show you what you can use. There's a free program, Audacity or Audacity, whichever way you want to say it. First of all, you need to bring in your file. So you open your file. And then you can see here we've got um, quite a few files. If you notice, I've done one there already, which is analog MP3, analog film OGG, and analog film .wave. And they're all three different formats. Now, the OGG will not play in DaVinci Resolve. So we click that one and we open it. And there we have it. Very simple. File. We export as a wave. Export it back to the same file if you want. Put any details for the file you want to include. And say OK. And that's it. As simple as that, guys. So you've now converted it. Now when you go into your DaVinci Resolve, you just need to add it in as a new file. So here we are guys and now we're going to need to put the actual file that we've converted into our sound library. What we've got here is the sound library in the Fairlight tab and my database for my music is film music. You may well see Fairlight sound library which is a free one or any other kind of database but for this one, I'm going to use film music. And to find it, I'm just going to hit one, two, three stars. And there's all my files. And as you can see, I've got 63 results. And these are all the files I've got. All you need to do is go to the Add tab, which is this, Add Library. Go back to the file folder that you've got the, uh, the library in, which is Film Music. Select that. Would you like to rescan the path and add new files? And say yes. Add three clips. They've just been found. And then say OK. And that's how you add the new files into your DaVinci Resolve. Well, there you go, guys. Uh, a nice, simple way of converting a file in a free program, Audacity, so that uh, DaVinci Resolve can use it. Um, for more tips and secrets that you might not know about, uh, subscribe or think about subscribing and leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Bye for now.